This one definitely has a retro vibe going on. This little pink one right here, I think is the sweetest thing. I have a bunch of super cute pink top. Hey loves, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I've got a super cute girly clothing haul and I've got a mix of like summer tops, cardigans, summer outfits, just some really cute stuff. So before we hop in, if you're new here and you enjoy videos like this, makeup, fashion, lifestyle, shopping vlogs, basically anything pink and girly, make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and push bell notifications. That way you never miss out on any of my future uploads. And I am announcing the giveaway winner from last week's giveaway at the end of this video. So make sure to stay until the end, grab your coffee, get your snack, get your credit card, come hang out. And yeah, let's go ahead and just hop straight in. All right, so I'm gonna start off first with one of my favorite tops out of everything that they sent over. Everything I mentioned today is from Belle Polk Boutique. It's an online clothing company. They have pretty much anything like flowery, pastel, girly that you could think of. Skirts, dresses, tops, complete outfits. I mean, they've got it all. So everything that I mentioned today will be linked down in my description box if you guys wanna go shop it. The top I'm wearing right now is actually from them as well. So this first one, of course, is a pink one. And it's a really cute halter top. Like I said, a lot of these are summer clothes, and here is what this first one looks like. So I like this one because it's got flowers and cherries all over it. I'm gonna insert some clips of everything of me trying it on and like pairing it up with outfits here in just a minute. But yeah, so here is the first top. Is this not so cute? It's got crisscross in the back. All of their tops are really soft and Everything I got today is medium, and it seems like everything has ran true to size so far. This one's got a little button detail up front. I just think this is so cute. The next one is pink as well, and here's what their packaging looks like, just to give you kind of like an overview of their brand. It says Belle Poke Boutique Elegant Retro, and it says Vintage and Elegant for the New Generation. They have a lot of like 1950s inspired outfits and stuff. Just really, like I said, vintage, floral, flowery, very girly. So this next one is actually one that I wore last week in one of my videos and a lot of you guys were commenting on it. This one is so cute. So it's got strawberries all over it. It's pink and I love how it's got the little bow right in the middle. All of their tops are like very fitted throughout up here. So it kind of gives you a little bit of a lift for the girls. And another thing that I really love about all these tops that they sent over is on the inside, the lining, like when you put this on, you're not gonna be able to see through it at all. So but yeah, this one right here, so cute, especially for summertime, the strawberries. And I actually paired that one up with a pair of white shorts last week and it was just a really cute outfit with the wedges and everything for summer, super cute. So next up, I've got this pink collared top. Honestly, this is probably my second favorite top out of everything, the lace detail on this. This is just another fitted, little fitted t-shirt and it's got the polka dots up here and the lace detail and the little sleeves are cuffed. Like I said, I love the way that their tops are just kind of fitted to you. So yeah, this one I think would be really cute with a pair of black shorts or black pants. I mean, you could wear this pretty much with anything, but I think this would be really cute with some black bottoms. Next up, I've got another cute blue top. This one is also cherry inspired and it is a halter top. It does tie around the neck. You guys, how cute is this? Oh my gosh. I love the color combo on this and something about the cherries mixed in with the blue. I don't know, it's just a whole vibe in itself. But yeah, this one it ties up around the neck. It's a halter top. And then on the back, it's got this little cinched accent on it also has oops sorry it's also got some little buttons going down the middle i think this is absolutely adorable especially for summertime with the whole cherry theme and all that love this and next up i've got so i went with a mixture of summer and fall tops 
So this next one I've got right here is gonna be really cute for the fall because we're not far off. Personally for me, like after July, I feel like we're already in the fall. Something about, you know, going back to school and Halloween is right around the corner. I am so ready for fall. So this one is gonna be so cute come fall time. This has lace sleeves on it and they, they also have like tool on the side of it. This would be really cute, especially for like a little bridal luncheon or something. I mean, anything, but for some reason, this just kind of reminds me of I don't know, a wedding or something, I guess because it's got the tool on it. But how cute is this sweater? And at the bottom, it is banded. But yeah, I think this is adorable. This one is a little bit see-through, so I'll have to wear a white tank top underneath. But yeah, I love this one, especially just for the sleeves, you know, the sleeves right there, love. All right, I had to readjust my camera because I feel like my lighting keeps going in and out some reason when I sit over here by my couch with that neon light behind me I feel like it always throws it off anyways all right so next up I've got another this one is a cardigan actually and like I said at the beginning they have a lot of like retro style clothes this one it kind of reminds me of like something a college girl would have wore in the 50s I think it's really cute it also kind of gives me a little bit of clueless vibes so i think this would be really cute with a skirt and a pair of boots during the fall this one's a really lightweight cardigan it's not real thick not real heavy and yeah it's yellow not usually a color i go for but yeah this one just kind of reminded me of clueless i don't know why and then here are the sleeves so super cute so on these next few you guys know um, especially like if you follow me on Instagram, I love a good black top. I feel like black, I don't know, one thing it goes with everything and also it's very slimming. I love my black tops and they had a ton of cute black tops um, in their in their shop. So this next one is a really cute, hopefully you guys can see this up close, a really cute black sweater. And the reason I chose this one is because it's got these like huge puff sleeves these bell sleeves i guess you would call them but yeah it's got these huge sleeves i think this is going to be adorable for the fall something about sweaters and i don't know i love the big sleeves that you can just kind of tuck your hand in and it's cold outside and you've got your coffee like yes so yeah i chose this one this one is kind of like it's got i don't know if you would call it I don't know almost kind of has like a little bit of a cashmere feel it is super soft but yeah this is probably one of my favorite sweaters that i picked out next one is pretty much the sister to the pink laced collared top i showed you guys a couple minutes ago except it's in black and i actually wore this one on vacation with a pair of white pants I really like this one because it's cinched in the front and anytime you got a shirt like this that's um just kind of cinched and has a little bit of layers to it. I feel like it kind of hides your tummy a little bit. So this is gonna be a go-to for me around that time of the month because one, it's black, and two, it kind of hides your tummy area. But it's just really cute on the way it's cut around your neck and then it's got the little ruffle sleeves on it. Like I said, I wore this with some white pants. This would be super cute as well with some white shorts or just a pair of denim jeans. Also a really good top for just like a casual date night or something. And then next up is another black top. This one is adorable. It's a halter top right here. Just ties up and then in the front. It's basically that shirt except in halter style. But yeah, it's got that same tummy control right there. And here is what the back looks like. Like I said, I'm a sucker for a good black top. And this one is super cute. And then I also got a pair of little black shorts. I thought this would be cute with one of the, probably that blue cherry top. I thought this would be really cute. I actually saw this um, on their website as one of their like promo picks with one of those halter tops. It was like a 50s pinup girl inspired, inspired picture. So I went ahead and picked up these little shorts. All right, so I'm down to the last two. And this next one is a swimsuit cover-up. This one is definitely like 50s style inspired. And they were like, we just wanna send you a swimsuit cover-up for 
summer and we're going to surprise you. So it's actually black, which is something I would have actually picked out myself. It's polka dot. If you can see the length, this is a little bit above the knees and yeah, just black polka dot. Here is what the back looks like. And it actually has padding on the inside. So yeah, super cute. And then this next one, this is the last piece. And of course it's another black top, but this one is just a little spaghetti strap. This one is kind of like a baby doll style. It's a little bit flowy at the bottom. Ooh, I got a little lint, <laughs> I got a little lint on it. But yeah, just a really soft black knit top, spaghetti strap. I love having, I don't know, this is just kind of a little basic staple piece in your closet. But yeah, so that is the haul from Belle Poop Boutique. Thank you guys so much for sending all that stuff over. If you guys want to shop anything that I've showed today, link is down in my description box. And I'm not sure if they gave me a discount code or not, but of course, if they did, I will always put that down in my description box as well. Definitely recommend checking them out. They have some really cute pieces at affordable prices. So now let's move on to the giveaway winner announced. The giveaway was for a set of SL Miss Glam. Oop, I've got it upside down or something. SL Miss Glam brushes and this Juicy Couture makeup bag. And before I announce the winner, I want to say thank you to everybody who entered. I always hate announcing the winner. I mean, I like it because I'm happy to um, make somebody smile. You know, you won. But then I also kind of hate it because I feel so bad because. I can only choose one winner. I do use a random picker, like a little giveaway picker app. So just know that anybody who entered, if you followed the rules, you were all entered in there and it's just random how it gets picked. But yeah, I always feel so bad. But you guys, like I always say, I try to do at least one giveaway a month on my channel. So if you don't win this time, you might win next time. So let's go ahead and get to who the winner is. I'm gonna pop up her screen name and comment right here in just a second elizabeth f i'm not going to pronounce your last name because i don't want to butcher it but congratulations elizabeth let me know your address and everything so i can get your goodies shipped out my email address is in my description box just send me an email and i will get your stuff shipped out to you and like i said thank you guys so much to everybody who entered i will have another giveaway coming up soon so just make sure that you're subscribed and you've got your notification bell on that way you always get notified when i post but yeah congratulations to elizabeth so happy for you thank you guys for all your support and speaking of which because i know most of the people that are here uh, towards the end of the video or some of my everyday subscribers that have been here for a while Thank you guys so much for all of your support the other day with that issue. I had on my bag video What a nightmare. It just goes to show you that one person. That's all it takes I think that that video had a thousand views on it and it only took one person to get that video taken down So I do want to say moving forward. I'm still gonna do my bag unboxings and all that um, I might have to do them a little bit different the way you know where I put the sellers at and all that so just know that and hey I said a prayer for that person you're obviously very unhappy and very miserable if you got to come to my channel like I don't bother anybody and I try to be upfront and honest about everything that I do so if you got to come over here and try to cause trouble and take me down like sending you prayers girl because obviously you need them but anyways, I did want to say thank you guys so much for the support and everybody who went back and clicked on that video, rewatched it, and commented just to support me. Thank you guys. Seriously, I, I really appreciate it so much. Like I said, I feel like we have kind of built a little community here of pink girls and yeah, thank you guys. All right, so I'm not going to continue on with my little, um, my little soap box here, but yeah. That is it for this video. I love you guys. We are almost to the weekend, so I hope you guys have a great rest of your week. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and watching, and I will see you back here on the next one. Bye, guys.